Welcome to day five in our hero's journey, exploring the 10 ox herding pictures from Zen Flesh, Zen Bones. Day five is called Taming the Bull. Now, this is halfway through the uh, 10 uh, pictures in the path to self-discovery and self-mastery. And the poem here reads, Taming the Bull. The whip and rope are necessary, else he might stray off down some dusty road. Being well-trained, he becomes naturally gentle. Then, unfettered, he obeys his master. So the imagery here is that there's still a need for a discipline, a routine, something that can keep you on the path to continual Kaizen or daily uh, continual improvement. So the whip and the rope would represent the discipline, the routines that you have in place that ensure that you uh, continue on the path. And those are still necessary. Uh, however, uh, without these, of course, you would you you might stray from. In, a, in other words, you have a routine going, and then you say, "Well, today I'll just leave it off." Maybe it's just taking a walk every day for twenty minutes at least, and then you say, "Ah, maybe I'll just rest today." And then the next thing you realize that uh, another day has gone by and you haven't taken your walk. Well. The same thing is true in any discipline, that you need a sense of momentum. And yet, once you've got that going, just taking that first step will make it very easy to continue. Uh, this is really the secret to continuing on your New Year's resolutions, which typically only last a few days. Uh, in Japanese, there's a proverb uh, or a phrase, mikabozu, uh, which means the three-day priest. So on the first day, uh, he determines that he will set out on a sacred path. Three days later, he's forgotten all about it. So we don't want that to happen in our own journey towards self-discovery and self-mastery. So being well-trained, he becomes naturally gentle. So it's easy to follow your routine. If you just get started, then unfettered, he obeys his master. So then the, the work, the discipline starts to work its magic of connecting mind uh, and body through skill. So join me tomorrow when we look at day six in the 10 ox herding pictures.